3D object snaps. So we get a whole new set of object snaps uh, for 3D versus 2D. So if I come down here and turn on my object snaps, for example, that's only turning on my 2D. So if I right click on it and go to my object snap settings, you'll see that these are my object snaps for 2D, but I do have a tab here for 3D object snaps. I can turn these on and that gives me a unique set of object snaps just for 3D. So I can go to the vertex, which would be like the corner of an object. I can go to a midpoint on an edge, which is on the edge of an object midpoint. Center of the face, that's going to put me in the center of this face. So plops the center, very handy one. And uh, so we have also a knot, right? So we have a knot is snaps on to a knot on a spline. We have perpendicular to uh, the face and we have nearest the face. So the ones I use most are really these three up on top, okay? And to give you an example here, um, let's say I want to just come over here and I'm going to do a shift right click and I'll go to 3D snap and I'll say I want to go to center of the face and now it found that center of the face so now I can come out here and pick my radius and then I can come out here and specify the base radius for example and And then I can actually pull the center of the of the uh, cylinder out here. So I have the center of the cylinder at the center of that face. So um, that's a very handy, these 3D object snaps. You can use 2D object snaps. So I can go to the end point of the line uh, or the midpoint of the line. Those do work, but certain ones are much better uh, at work. And then on snapping to the center of the 3D face, to the vertex of an object, uh, to the midpoint of an edge, to whatever, like the midpoint of that edge. Those are very handy ones. So, to, once again, 3D object snaps. We're going to come down in and we're going to right click. We're going to go object snap settings. We're going to go to 3D object snap, make sure they're turned on and have whichever one you want in the running mode turned on. So, then that allows them to come in and just you can see oop, it found it because it's a running I can pick on that I can say it's a quote a half inch let's say and I can pull out the height and say oh it's one inch and I ended up just attaching a cylinder onto the center of the cylinder onto the center of that face so 3D object snaps help us in our construction and editing of our 3D models.